Well, I've been through a lot of storms down here, and this is, the Carter wasn't nothing compared to this. It's the worst one I ever seen. I believe they underestimated the wind. It must have been 130 or, you know. Did y'all see the ferry down there in the people's backyard? Well, we're in San Leon, and the, the, all this was done mainly by a tidal surge before the storm got here. By midnight, the eye passed right over, so you can see pretty devastation. Not, well, I was on the only boat that made it out of here. We had scuba gear, food, generators, everything on the boat, and I mean, it threw us around like a rag doll. As you can see, it's in these people's front yard, and when uh, we got on it, it was right here on these spuds, and they broke off. So we went all the way to Eagle Point, back through this building, and it spun around again and ended up on the beach. Yeah. In front of my house and that house, it wouldn't have happened if you all hadn't put that barge over there. That barge took out San Leon Marina, and all that crap came right into my oh, house. Oh, we were smacking and right into, into that house and right into this house. Yeah. We were doing fine until 12.30 when that barge broke loose. Yeah. And then all the crap went into my house over there. Well, man, we almost flipped over out there. What the hell was that barge doing here in the first place? You know the storms. We, you know well, the storms. Me, that we're good. Okay. I mean, they're making a bar this and a restaurant out of it. A, this was the worst one I've been through in uh, in this area. You know, we got a little more water than we expected, but uh, yeah. it wasn't so much the uh, the strength of the storm. It was it just had the perfect angle for pushing water up here. You know, the angle was just perfect for pushing the water up. We have water about this deep right here. Yeah. But like I said, if you look at the rest of the shoreline, the rest of the shoreline, I don't believe is all that bad. It was basically when the marina, when the marina got destroyed, all the riffraff was was coming right this way. That's what got us. Come home yesterday, and they come down here, but they the water so high, you know, and. Uh, they don't let us uh, come down here, but and uh, we just come down here today, and uh, see my bow okay, but uh, my my brought the bow over there to bed, you know, a lot of bow over there bed, you know, to go way up in the wood here. I was through at Leisha in 1983, and this is where it was worse than Leisha. For this area. For, for this area, uh, I got a little RV park in. It didn't do just a little bit to mine, but it really, it uh, it's wiped everybody out down here. You got, you got a big barge, that big barge, it, it went like on land, and then you got uh, this restroom down here. Uh, what's the name of that? Top water. Top water, it's gone. 18th Pier wiped out. All the uh, Sunset Loud just wiped out. Uh, Anyway, we just, it's, it's just everything gone. <laughs> what we really need here is uh, some ice and water. Um, what's today's what, the third day? And we don't have anything, no electricity. And so a lot of people are losing their food. And apparently they're helping, what, everybody in Galveston and Houston, but not San Leon. <laughs> We're the lost, uh, what do you call it? the the lost stepsister. <laughs>